Wait up, bro. Got some exploring today. There's a sewer and everything. <laughs> Hi. Um, excuse me while I explore. Nothing around here. Oh, shit, that was a wall. That was totally on purpose. Anything? Some Donwall whiskey there. Got a ramp. Emma's hardware for all your hardware needs. Good to. Oh. Sorry, that just looked like you could climb up there. I was like, ooh, there's gonna be treasure. Treasure. Oh. Everyone has these flippin' dog things. I see something glowing. I don't know what that noise was. Next up from a book on the far continent, Pandicia. At the Academy of Natural Philosophy, they speak of the Pandician continent as a place of wonder, where all of life has entwined and blossomed across ocean, uh, aeons, producing a vibrant ecology and rivaled in a civilised world. The overseers from the Abbey of the Everyman, by contrast, talk of horror and heresies, of cults, of submen engaged in brutal, perverse rituals. The few who have travelled to the far continent and come back to the isles, those who have actually touched the soil there, have returned with notes that describe vast deserts, deep jungles and outlandish creatures that defy belief. Once in a generation, a great effort is mounted to build a colony there, in hopes of this someday growing into a part, port city to rival Dunwall itself, but to date these attempts have all ended in madness and failure. Cape of Teeth Mm, cool, get some dollars. Someone's got like a cute little home in here, don't they? Cute little shindig down there. Hey, is that? Oh, no, just a brick, Jade, just a brick. Cute little viewpoint thing. Good, good, good. Another oh, hound pit, is it the same one? Yeah. Those two dogs must be famous or some shit. Ooh, look inside. Not much going on. Right. Now, I go beyond you. The Loyalists. I expect they're hard at work in there. This joint looks like you're dead whoever really killed the Empress. He must have been like, oh yeah, he's just gone to explore shit. I'm just gonna light up a sig. The Lord Regent is a shriveled prick and a liar. Well, someone has a low opinion of him. I try. I think that's a benefit of looking through keyholes. You learn things. You learn. Now, do I go over there or do I explore? Welcome to the Hound Pit, sir. No man. Hello, sir. 
I am Wallace, and this is Cecilia. He interrupted you, bitch. You have been informed of your arrival and will do our best to stay out of your way while you conduct your business. Yes, there is a servant here as well. Can I not talk? The Admiral served in the Navy under the Empress. But something happened with the Lord Regent that drove the Admiral out. If I understand it right. Well, I was going to talk to you, but I am not chasing you down. Because that might. Oh! Well, oh. hi. So he's doing shit. Get on him. Get on him. Oh, that's that door. Yeah. And this is a tower. Good, good, good. Oh. Wow. Oh. Apparently I can just do that. Some more whiskey if I wish. Not much going on. I suppose it's probably going to be like open up more as I go. Blood from the eyes. Delightful. That is the gate from before. Yes, I see. Oh, I was going to like post did notice the rules of conduct here are as expected for a something. Well, I was just waiting for you to see them through the window. But, alas. Report any sickness. I will pick up that Tyrion or Maybe Tyrion will just start jump out and be like, use insults against you. Like armor. Oh, then it can never be used to hurt you. The band say watch. Nah, I'm alright mate. Can I, can I, eh, there we go. Keyhole. Abandoned apartment. I'm not really sure what I was expecting. Ooh! Obviously I need a key at some point. Find the key for that keyhole. See, that actually looks like a nice, a nice pub. Mm. The rest of it's not as great. Mm, kind of blocked off. Attention, citizens of Dunwall. The old port district has been added to the evacuation. Anything? Oh, trash bin. The month of sea has increased. Nothing. The Lord Regent has decreed that plague ordinances will remain in effect through the month of rain. Stay alert and stay loyal. Hello? I just duped right past you. Sneak, sneak. Shit. Can continue this later, Lord Tennant. Men of the hour. Corvo. That is an attractive man. A true servant of the Empire, like you. So the Lord needs you to recognize your claim. And I'm Lord Shepard Tennant. I represent an ability. But we all act as equals here at the Hamlet. This is a momentous occasion. I'm going to come out. We've been built a coalition to Aimed at ending the Lord Regent's The hands are huge. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young lady Emily and seeing her crown as a place. We've got big plans. We can't do any of it without you. We need your skill, your ability to fight. And in helping you, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered you. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you recover. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Pierre. He's young at many times, but his industrious mind lies in that land. Yeah, Pierre is as much an artist as a musician. He's going to be crafty and weird in you. Go talk to him, and we'll get some sleep. Blow no smoke in my face, you bitch. Press select. Fishing cues. Piero is an inventor who is able to craft and upgrade equipment. Piero spends most of his time in a workshop. Mission items? Nope. Tasks. 
Meet Piero. Near the dock. Good to have you with Nothing against the others, but there's no sense for a man who's done service for the There. Pretty got teleported back to his face. Can I like whack him? Yes, okay, I will talk to him. Uno memento. No, oh, I don't need any. Thank you, balls. Ooh! That's where all the modern looking in it. Apricot toilet. Oh my god, I'm gonna save that. I really want one now. Damn it. Oh, this is conveniently open now. I'll be cracking your weapons here. All custom weapons. For you, I will create two. Use. I can use a vice. Star tart. Get some money for that. Excerpt from a recent book detailing Solikov's machines. One of the advantages of the Solikov's technologies is that they share the same magnetic socket for the tanks of processed whale oil they use as fuel. When a tank is exhausted, another can be plugged in to place with ease. The process is simple enough that any common workman or even the lower guardsmen of the city watch can handle the task. This applies to the arc pylon and wall of light security systems, as well as the powered carriages used for transport by those few who are wealthy enough to afford them. The only obvious downside of Sol Sokolov's designs is the vitality of the tanks themselves, volatility of the tanks themselves. A few incidents have occurred resulting in damage to property or bodily harm whenever one of the tanks has exploded. Gotcha. Grindstone. Oh. Excerpt from a series of newspaper articles from prominent natural philosophers by Piero Joplin. It is through no fault of my own that the average citizen has expressed a preference for Sokolov's elixir over my own formula, sold as Piero's remedy. A name I did not choose, if you must know the truth. The public has spoken its usual message of idiocy, spinning their coin as a means of selecting Sokolov's formula over mine, which I believe to be equal if not superior. Much has been made over the popularity of these concoctions as a means of resisting this remarkable new plague. I say remarkable because the strain works with an efficiency we have not seen in the history of the Empire. This plague, now making its way through the city of Domwall, is unrivalled in its effectiveness. I have studied it within the blood of those so effect afflicted and it's nearly perfect, elegant in fact. And while it is true that Piero's remedy and Sokolov's elixir are known to protect the body against a plague equally, my own has properties not fully understood, which reduce which no, which relate to the mind itself and the spirit. And it's in that way that it is in this way that my formula wins out. Here is when where one should pay attention to this contest. For you, see Sokolov's Alexa, with its emphasis on the brute animal body, is a cross goo better suited to the livestock. The subtle and secret variants in the key ingredients making up Piero's remedy ensure that it works on higher functions that separate humankind from the mindless blue jawed hagfish swimming in the Red Haven River. Good to know, buddy. Bitter leaf crematorium and fluid works. Fiero, no, I will not sign off on these purchases. A bag of powdered crystal, Tivian ore. Found some. What's wrong with the metals and crystal? King's fe feathers. If you need feathers, sacrifice your own pillow. Damn. Maybe at the academy, everything you need was paid for by tariff and handed out willy nilly. But this is my bar and what's left of it. 
and we're operating on a budget. We're running low on oil, food, Alexa, building materials and everything else, so you've got to slow down. While I'm footing the bill, I will not approve your purchases unless they're absolutely required. No more copper wire or special herbs. If you need those things, go out and scavenge them. Half the city is in ruins, so no one is going to miss any of the odd crap you seem to need. So obviously if I pick up something, that must mean I can use it in... Is that supposed to be a portal? I hope so. Um, can use it later. There's not even, there's nothing in here. Let's just close it. Oh, no, we'll bang the bottom. Whoa. Nope, nothing. Oh, there's so much to read up here. Right, let me have a look around first. Okay, there's a tank. I need the key. This bend's empty tank. No, I'm good. This guy is slightly cuckoo. Sokolov no longer has the upper hand with regard to supplies of whale oil. The good admiral has paid for the installation of my own system, which will enable me to work in this place. The oil tank dispenser, when activated, will produce an empty vessel for filling. Da 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 da. The system is sound and well engineered. It appears that the Greaves oil company has done something correctly for once. That just tells me how to use that, which is pretty self explanatory anyway. Whale oil processing. Exert from the founder of the Greaves Whale House. Out at sea, they secure the beast with hooks, which lines cost from the main ship and from several smaller boats. Boys keeps the whole whale from diving deep. Once it's caught, a larger hook is driven through the tail, which is used to hoist the creature up to the chute. They moan and bellow for some time as the men get them onto the deck, then lift them into the scaffolding overhead. The ship adjusts its prow and returns to port in Dommel, where the crew works on the great creature slicing off the fattiest parts while it still lives. Well, delightful. The uh, whale vivisection. Remarkably, each specimen I had the pleasure of studying during the voyage possessed some minor variants in physiology. On the second leg of the trip, east of Tivia, the crew hauled aboard a female, some 42 inches in length. They estimate she weighed 35 tons, and the ship sat low, rocking side to side through the night with her thrashing. By candlelight, I took her apart, sketching and taking notes. Against her bellowing, I cut into the ma mass of tentacles around her mouth, where then I found roar upon roar of, row upon row of teeth, and a baleen running along the upper jaw. Through this broom-like structure, I assume she filtered food from the water that was too small to be chewed. What about these, uh, whales? Commissioned by the Lord Regent in the face of the growing plague crisis, the dead counter is a position that will only be given to officers, usually of junior or middle grades. In most matters of edict or curfew enforcement, these officers will defer to the acting officer on duty. However, any dead counter will have command in situations reduced to the plague and the handling of the dead, including those with late-stage plague symptoms called weepers, in common parlance. Starting in the month of rain, interested officers may apply for the test, and if accepted for the two-week training tour, pay will be administered in coin and rations of elixir at one and one-half normal pay grade. Oh, okay, this is the last one. Of course I have attempted to improve upon Sokolov's designs. Of course, and why not? After all, it's likely that his thinking was influenced in some small way by our time together at the Academy. We are all part of 
a community striving to unknot the mysteries of the cosmos. Even those among us who possess the greatest minds often led to a fruitful line of consideration by, how does one say it, or intellectual subordinates. Sokolov is no exception to this. Despite the glamour of genius, he has cast over the aristocracy. And further, it is true that many of my experiments have failed. No need to gossip about it behind my back, in your social clubs, and in the very chambers of the academy itself. Great ambition requires risks. You may laugh now at my door to nowhere, but someday you will not. Your children will likely see it as commonly as you see the electric lamps lighting our streets at night. But a few short years ago, you would have laughed at Sokolov's arc pylon or wall of light. Your laughter, your condensing smiles, they are nothing but evidence of your own limited imagination. Well, that's red. That was a lot to read. Actually, wait, is there anything on the floor anywhere? No? Whale oil is a mm, glowy colour. situation feels desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to crack the things on the Tell me what I can make for you. Let's see. Oh, I need some more sleep bolts. Um, eight out of ten. Let's get five. Uh, mm, mm. I don't know what that is. Grenade. Rewire tool that allows you to rewire a circuitry into a swing. Yeah, sure. Oh, disable security devices will make them work in your favour by using a rewire tool on the circuitry panel for the security device you want to hack. This consumes a rewire tool. Rewire walls of light, dark pylons, and watchtowers. Rewired alarms will be fully disabled. Okay. Let's see what upgrades there are. Accuracy, mm, it already has a target system, so it doesn't really matter. Range, reload, faster reload. Combat sleep dart, sleep dart sensitive effect is immediate even in combat. Makes sword more effective when locking blades. Don't use it. Pistol upgrade, allows pistol. Allows you to magnify your view. Reese's bullet storage capacity. Bulk capacity. Let's get this. And this. And can I get anything else? Nope. Okay. Why is he so creepy? Yeah, sure, I need head. Yes. No, I'd like to look around for a while before I bed down. Very well. 
Thank you, creepy guy. Let's go in here. And let's go have a look around. Ooh. See, I knew this was a good thing. Do do. Nope. Do do. What's down here? Drop. Some sort of. Oh. Processed whale oil. And whatever that is. Oh, it's just a tool. I thought it was like an a um, RPG thing. Because I'm silly. Oh, there's a door. Oh, what's in here? Ooh. Sewers. I'm, I'm good for now. I think I've been in enough sewers for a while. But that's, you know, that's handy to have. I'm pleased I'm adventuring. Justin, and so will I. Hi. Do you not trust me? No, I'm good, thanks, mate. I'm busy. 201. 201? I can't speak. What is this? Oh, that was expensive. Hell yeah. I know I'm going back to Piero before I go to sleep. Oh, hi. I saw you at court in Happy Days. But you might not remember. I was once a close ally to the Lord Regent, Iron Burroughs, back when he was just the spy master. He's one of the little bastards. You just ignore the fact I stole your stuff, mate. Oh my god, you have an apricot tartlet too? 